I'm Lawrence Tyndall here at Glidefast Consulting, and in today's ServiceNow demo, I'm excited to show you the Dell warranty integration that we've built here at Glidefast. Before I take you through the integration, I'd like to talk about why the integration is important within your IT asset management practice, the benefits of having warranty visibility, and the business outcomes that can be achieved with this integration. So why is this integration important to your ITAM practice? Whether you're a small, medium, or enterprise-sized organization, having visibility into your Dell hardware asset warranty statuses is crucial, as it allows you to understand what assets are covered by Dell in the event of damage or failure. By having warranty visibility, you're able to outsource hardware issues to Dell, thus allowing your IT service desk to focus on more important issues. Being able to save on IT support costs is more important than ever before, especially with most workforces working remotely from home. By having visibility into your active warranties, you're able to reduce your total cost of ownership for your Dell assets, increase your return on investment ROI, and you're able to streamline the support process for affected assets when incidents are logged. Now that we've covered the importance of this integration and the business outcomes that you can achieve, let's jump into the system and take a look at it. So to populate ServiceNow with warranty data for your hardware assets, we've set up the system so it automatically pulls warranty data directly from Dell TechDirect when an asset is created. And then in order to keep the system up to date when extended warranties are purchased, the system automatically grabs new warranty information on a weekly basis. This ensures your assets will always have all warranty information available. Please note, in order to pull warranty information into the system, each of your Dell asset records need to have a valid Dell service tag in the serial number field. In order to keep the integration as clean as possible, we're using the out-of-the-box contracts module to store the warranty information, which allows us to store and display multiple warranty line items for each Dell asset in our system. Now that we've talked about how the integration works, let's go and create a Dell hardware asset and we'll be able to see how the warranty information is automatically populated. I'm going to head over to the hardware assets module and then click on the new button. In the model field, I'm going to select the Dell Latitude 5420, and in the model category field, I'm going to select Computer. In the serial number field, I'm going to enter the serial number for this asset. Now I'm going to right click on the form header and click Save. At this point, the integration process will be running, and the warranty information should be populated in a few seconds. Now, if we head over to the Contracts tab and click on the Refresh button, we'll see all of this amazing warranty data is now available for this laptop. As you can see, the integration pulls in the service level description, the warranty SKU from Dell, the start and end date, and the service level code. And as you can imagine, the possibilities are truly endless with this integration. You can integrate this data into your ITSM processes, your asset refresh process, etc. And that is all for today's demo on the Dell warranty integration in ServiceNow. If you're interested in learning more about this integration and would like to have it implemented within your ServiceNow instance, feel free to reach out to us here at Glidefast Consulting today.